In this video, we are going to be ranking every single video I, every single Shell Shocker video I have posted on my main channel, PLG Nova. In over four years, I actually have uploaded a lot more than I thought I have. And I know there's a lot of big fans out here, but some of these videos, I can almost guarantee you haven't watched. I bet there's only a few people who are watching who have actually watched at least a little bit of every single video right here. But let's begin. I have a lot of tears, because, I mean, my content, wide range of watchability, that's the word. First, Nova versus Iwa. This was one of my first 1v1s I actually posted on the channel that was all just a 1v1. I would say this is actually a good watch. Um, because it was like when me and Iwa and all those YouTubers almost were like at their, at their like highest, right? Like they like, it was all very hype. Like the Iwa events. Nova and Iwa were being talked about a lot in the community, so we decided to do a 1v1. It was pretty entertaining. It was a different 1v1 that most people don't really see. Next, noob versus pro versus god. All right, this is one of the old videos before 2022. This is the first video that I uploaded that actually popped off. I think this has 30,000 views now, and at the time, it was my... And for very long, like very long, until like my 100,000 kill video, and that was already like getting popular, this was still my most popular video. The reason why is because I actually just had a pretty darn good idea, which was obviously the new versus pro versus god kind of trend. I first saw this with Professor Jax's video, new versus pro versus hacker, but I feel like I actually did... Not better, I'm not going to say that, but it was a pretty bad video, I'm not going to lie. But it did start off, it did blow up my channel, and it's not a horrible video, it's an original idea. Next, another, one of the oldest videos I have, 30 kill streak. This one I just wouldn't watch, it's just very mid, the music is also horrible. Two, getting 200,000 kills. Now I'm going to be honest, this, isn't, this did not blow up as much as I expected although it hasn't got like actually amounted that many views it hasn't had enough time to amount a lot of views but i still think it was actually a lot better than my 100,000 kill video i'm gonna put this at banger this was a banger every i didn't i didn't see any hate comments on it next i don't even remember galaxy sniper is super op again one of the older videos i made a little montage with this sniper it was I wouldn't watch it. It was kind of... It was... It's not good. It's just a very simple montage. Uh, Gooba. I think that's the first montage I actually, like, uploaded and kept on the PLG Nova channel. Because if y'all don't know, I originally uploaded a Godzilla montage as my first ever video on this channel. But guess what? It's gone forever. But no, this is actually my first montage that I uploaded. It's pretty embarrassing. It's, it's not good. Okay, oh wow. Now we have this. Hazbat versus Nova. I'm gonna say right now, this video made history. This video could have not gotten... Like, it could have not... It, it was almost like it was scripted. Like, the ending, everything went perfect. The fact that there's not a clear winner just reinforces that, like rivalry even more before this was out and the fact that hazmat's unfortunately gone and my return almost this video it made history this is simply probably top three best 1v1s of all time definitely probably the most hype i would say the ones that can compare are like freaking the ones with gray's ocean gray's ocean versus wiz or hazmat versus professor Jax. i would say this is definitely up there though especially with the video itself video went beautifully even though it was rushed next three time ewa event winner i will put this out legendary because this just cemented my absolute domination in the ewa events also this was like a 30 
freaking minute long video and people actually watched all the way through. I, I put a lot of work into this video, I'm not going to lie. And that, I mean, we had Viking, we had AK. I think we had some, oh yeah, Dusty as well. Like, dude, this was an amazing video. If you have not watched this video, this is amazing. It is the perfect collection of seriously impressive moments funny as heck moments betrayal it's everything it's a it's a story it's so good it is legendary okay bye bye oh my god uh, actually i'm gonna put this in embarrassing because bye bye this was the first time that i like quit shell shockers and i made this really over dramatic video my voice is bad i I don't like it. It's embarrassing to watch. I don't like it at all. Next. Yaboya Gun Game Race. This was probably, again, at my hype when I was, like, collabing with everyone, dude. I collabed with so many CCs. It was great. It was great. This time was great. But this video, not only was it a good freaking idea, it also performed really well. Again, I won. That doesn't really matter, though. A lot of funny moments. Honestly? Hmm. I think I'm about. I'm think I'm gonna put this at banger, but it's higher than 200k. This video is really good. It's short, simple, simple challenge, simple idea. We're uh, well edited, funny, everything. Shell shockers, but I'm going god mode again. Very old, almost four years now. Um, this one I just wouldn't watch. It's just some mid airs and stuff of me like thinking I'm like the best damn person in the game. But realistically, I I looked pretty bad, actually. Next, YouTubers versus Twitch. I might put this at a low legendary. Because this, again, this is when all the hype for all the collabs were, like, at its peak. Like, I was with K4. I think that was the first video I actually uploaded with K4. I think. And... Iwa as well. If we had Iwa and the VC, holy crap, that would have popped off. But not. Nah, it was a really good idea. It was super fun as well of seeing all the CCs. I think that's one of my most popular videos. Um, it was a really good idea. Technically, this video idea wasn't even mine. It was JW's, so shout out to him. That was a great idea. Glad I could record it and all the funny moments as well. All right, next. 1v1ing the worst hacker in Shell Shockers. This one, I think this has, I think this is an overrated video. I'm going to be completely honest. This is a kind of an overrated video. But I will say it is a good watch. Um, Because it's just funny. It's just me 1v1ing this hacker. It's pretty bad hacker. You could barely even tell he's hacking. But that's why I put worse than the title. But this video popped off and again continued to help me grow. Ooh, world record kill streak. I'm not going to say this made history, but this is definitely legendary. And I'm going to put this above YouTubers Twitch. The way I died, ironic as hell. The way I, it's it's how I always end the videos with a freaking grenade death. Got a world record. It, it's now in the Shell Shockers Wikipedia page, which is kind of ridiculous, honestly. I'm in the Shell Shockers Wiki. For having the highest legitimate kill streak, although I know now, yes, Buster Ben did beat it. Although I still got FFA, okay. I still have the FFA record, so I will definitely take that, and I probably will have the FFA record for very long because all the old records were all in teams and captured the spatula. All of them were. So, yeah. Next. When you've played Shell Shockers for three years. This is actually a... Ooh, well, I'm not going to put this at Legendary, but this is definitely a hell of a banger. I always rewatch this one. It's really nice to see the actual progression through. And it's just a good video. It's very, very simple. It's, it's just really good. Oh god, this is another old one. The I think it's my video I made with the Oons, but it like has Aimbot or something. It was really cringe it was like i got the new oons weapon when it first came out back in 2020 and i just got some very mid clips with it very mid 
Although I did like the thumbnail. The thumbnail was original. Next. 1000 Sensitivity Challenge. This one... Honestly, I think this one's underrated. This was around the time of the health mod video. Like, when I was actually starting to blow up. I feel like this is actually a good watch. It was funny. It was actually pretty funny in my opinion. I really like this video, the thumbnail editing. I don't really like my voice, but I honestly feel like, yeah, this is underrated. For a year, only amassing 19,000 views. I feel like compared to my other videos, this should at least be at 25K, but I'll definitely take it. Um, very good video, very good idea as well. Um, all right, next. Oh, this was, okay. Now this isn't old, but this isn't, like the nova you know this was in that weird in between stage let me pull it up on my channel it was this stage these three videos no sorry these four videos it was after my second time quitting and i uploaded four pretty darn good videos all of these popped off in their own way the this was I when I was actually like improving my standard for content and it definitely definitely worked but this video that was probably the worst out of all of them I'm gonna be honest this one is just very mid although I will say it's a better watch than new vs pro vs god it's literally just showcasing a premium egg k although it's it's not really impressive it's just it's just pretty mid I'm actually gonna put it below this so long this was my 100 subscriber special montage when I would actually do montages for milestones. Um, it's in like 360p. It's it's just mid. I would put it right in between. Um, it's a good song. I mean, the edits aren't amazing. They're not anything crazy. But, um, yeah. My first Shell Shockers video. 32 kill streak. I hate the music on it. I hate it so much. Why did I put that music? I don't know. If you watch this, I apologize. It is embarrassing, but it's not as embarrassing as, embarrassing as these two videos. Ooh, pistol only. All right, pistol only. Honestly, this was probably my best video from the old days. The reason why, I'm gonna put this above nova versus iwa the reason why if I, if you actually like my content i would suggest watching this one because this video not only is it the pistol kill streak world record that has stood for three years it's also just kind of funny like it's pretty well edited it's a pretty freaking good idea my voice and everything make it all like 10 times funnier it's actually it's pretty funny. I really like it. I like that video. That was the only video that I'm actually like proud of nowadays from the old days. If that made any sense. All right. New year, new Nova. You see, that title is pretty cringe. I'm not going to lie. And also the montage is pretty cringe. The song isn't so good. And the edits. I mean, the edits, those were my best edits, I would say, for a montage. But come on. I, I don't know. I don't know about the montage. I would say it's pretty mid. I would say it's a high mid. I wouldn't say it's a good watch. I wouldn't really recommend watching it. But yeah. Alright. Shell shockers, but I'm being hunted by a stream sniper. I think that's what it's called. Or I'm being or my friend is secretly stream sniping me. So this was actually a genius idea I had back in the day. Again, this is from that era, that weird era I was talking about with these four videos. But this video was the one that actually popped off the most because um, it was a collab with Phantom Zero One Zero, and it was also just a freaking good idea. It wasn't, it's not super enjoyable to watch, but at the time, it's it's pretty good. It was pretty good at the time. All I'm I'm gonna put this at mid. It's a pretty mid video. Shell shockers, but I have the best keyboard. Something like that. Um, again, same same time period as I mentioned earlier. I wouldn't watch it. It's just a hand cam on a keyboard and me hitting some very, I mean, mid shots. 
I would say this is barely scratching it, though. Hmm. Actually. Yeah, I think that should go up here. It's just mid. Okay. Oh my gosh. 100,000 kills in Shell Shockers. I think this would be unfair if I did not put it in made history. I wouldn't really say necessarily made history in the game, but I mean, it's my most popular video. This video popped off so much more than I was expecting. Sui made a video like this a few years ago, got nowhere close to the view count. This is the video that actually blew up my channel from seven, like 500, 600 subs to like a thousand and getting CC in like two months. Like that's how fast it was. This video carried it. If I would not be where I am right now without this video, this video would not be made. Oh, a lot of other ones as well. Ooh, speedrunning shell shockers part one. So this was the again an old video. Um, this was the first time that I introduced the idea of speedrunning shell shockers. Nobody else had ever done it at the time. Actually. No, I remember, yeah, Kizomatic actually did do a video like this before mine. God damn it, I forgot. Anyway. I was still one of the first to do it. And it actually did kind of get a little popular. So popular, in fact, that Lucy Poo saw it and beat it. Because, I mean, it wasn't that impressive. A 305, come on. It's pretty bad. I would say this is a... It's a wouldn't watch. I, would, I wouldn't watch it. I would say it's actually, like, down here. I do not like that video. Alright, another old video. It's a freaking update video. Like, just come on. Who likes update videos? Come on. 67 kill streak. It has cringy music. It's 10 minutes long. It's not embarrassing, but it's just I just wouldn't watch it. Oh, shoot. Okay, this video. Um, the PLG Nova documentary. I don't even know what this was called. I think it was like the fall and rise of PLG Nova. This kind of cringe. The editing is pretty bad, I'm not gonna lie. It's a 40 minute long video, and it's all about like, it's all about like, how I was good and then I got bad in 40 minutes. I would rather die than have to watch that again. That was, that is beyond embarrassing. I have not watched it in probably a year. I'm not gonna lie, I haven't watched it in probably a year. Top 10 snipes. Oh god, not another one. This video, I think this is my worst, like, actual video I made on the channel. Um, this video, first of all, is a 50 sub special. It had, it was like an actual, like, voice reveal, and it was pretty bad. That was a really bad time for my voice. Um, top 10 snipes of PLG Nova. Those were probably some of the worst snipes I've ever hit. Now that I look back on it, like, they're not even good for the time. They're just very mid, and I didn't even know. Like, I exaggerated it so much. I would say, like, number nine. Insane no-scope. And, like, hit someone point blank. Like, it was really embarrassing. I think I would genuinely rather kill myself. Not as much as the documentary, but this one's pretty bad. 48 kill streak. Um, This is probably my worst thumbnail I've ever made. I'm not going to lie. Or this one. Both of these are really bad. Although I would definitely say this one's worse. I would not watch it. Ooh. How I won the biggest Shell Shocker tournament. I don't care that people say this is clickbait. But this made history. Honestly. I might say this made more history than Has vs. Nova. I think this is my second... Yep, second most popular video. And this... This is what made this video. I think this is what actually made PLG Nova, PLG Nova. One, a little raging little bitch. <laughs> I raged so much in that video. Two, the determined, motivated, never giving up. That side of me really shined in this video. Uh, it, it came, it was also like a really long video, it was like 25 minutes long or something. I was at the bottom. 
I was not doing so well, like, performance-wise in the event. And then I won out of nowhere. Not really out of nowhere. But I developed strats. I developed strats that were eventually used in future EWA events. I was targeted. All the odds were against me. And this video eventually inspired me to make EWA Event 2, EWA Event 3, and someday I will eventually upload EWA Event 4. Yes, if you did not know, there is an EWA Event 4 coming out. And if you didn't know, there was an EWA Event 5. But, not only did I actually lose, yes, I lost an EWA Event. It was the fifth one. But the recording also was really shit, because I cropped it wrong. So, I deleted it. But yeah, as I said, this video made history. It was... it. Honestly, this video also blew up Iwa. Iwa became even more popular with this video and my Iwa event reign. This inspired me to do all the other events. This was the first Shellshockers event I really, like, seriously participated in. I won, and I said, let's win some more. And that's where all these other videos come from. So, I'm very thankful for that video. I think that video... That really summarizes the prime of PLG Nova. Prime content. It was amazing. Beautiful video. I think I gained, like, wait, I don't, I'm curious. Four freaking hundred. 400 subs from this video. That's ridiculous. That is genuinely ridiculous. Next. Okay, now we go to a really bad video. VIP montage. This was a video that I uploaded when the VIP, very important poultry, first came out into Shell Shockers instead of the Golden Nugget or whatever it was called. Oh, I kind of forgot it, to be honest. Um, they instead made a purchasable subscription, as everybody really knows now. And I decided, ah, eh, this could make a good montage. It was probably one of my shittiest montages of all time. I would say this goes in embarrassing. Pretty high embarrassing. Yeah, oh, uh, yeah, it was just bad. Ooh, okay, this one. Nova being the best stream sniper. This one is actually a pretty freaking good banger of a video. I ain't gonna lie. The thumbnail on this was really good. The reactions of all the streamers, me winning. It was actually a really good video. Although I would say, let me actually reorganize. Was 200k kills that bad? I kind of like it, but I don't think other people like it that much. All right, 50 kill streak. Okay, this one is just mid. Um, Iwa Event 2. Oh my gosh. What do I put this at? Do I put this at Legendary? Does this get Legendary status? I honestly think it does. Very low Legendary. Because it doesn't compare to these videos. But it's also not like it changed my channel. Or like... It's like a thing that people recognize me for. EU Event 2. That one was more of the filler ones. But this did um, introduce a new character. Phantom. Again. Or I guess it was a reintroduction. But this one. This video actually blew up his channel. Because again it got like 30,000 freaking views. And then Phantom got like 200 subs off it. Or something ridiculous. Because people really liked him in that video. Oh my god. Health mod video. This might have to go above... Ewa event winner. No, I can't. I can't. I can't. Okay. I'm going to say legendary again. Because. Because. Not only was it a really freaking good video idea. It was probably one of the funniest videos I've ever posted. And this was the video that I started getting, wrecking, get started getting recognized for. For being funny. Which is funny in its in of itself. Because that was not the point of the video at all. The other half of the video was actually pretty boring, but the first half is honestly pretty iconic. This was actually a pretty good video. I don't really like the thumbnail that much, but I mean, shit, it worked. 50,000 views, that's kind of ridiculous. I would say that is legendary status, because again, that's when people would start talking about me. So, yeah. Gang, gang. I'm not gonna lie, I think this may be my best montage ever. 
better than New Year, New Nova, better than the stupid VIP one. This one, it's not very impressive, kill-wise, editing-wise, or anything. The thing that carries it is the time that it was actually uploaded in, the song, and like almost like the nostalgia. Because back then, when this montage was uploaded, everybody was making montages like this. This was like the montage era, basically. This is when everybody wanted to make a montage. And I made one, and it's not bad. It's not, I wouldn't say it's cringeworthy. I would say this is not a horrible watch. I would say this is probably another one of those videos I made back when I was like 12 or, yeah, no, 12 or 11 years old that I'm actually proud of. Next. Another freaking kill streak video, are you serious? wouldn't watch it's not good best duo in shell shockers at the time uh, would i say this is legendary honestly i might say this is legendary no i can't i'll say this is a high banger the reason why is because this video a lot of people were this is around the time that people were having that goat discussion they were like, is Nova... Do you guys think Nova's the GOAT of Shell Shockers? Do you think he's the best player? I think he's the best player. And the people disagree. This video right here um, actually proved a lot of people how well I can do against some of the other GOATs. Dark Lord was in this. Peak. Pacific. I kind of freaking slaughtered all of them at some point. I didn't MVP. Also, people like people like Phobia, Haze. I'm telling you, some of the biggest names you see in competitive shell, either previously or now, were in this video, and they lost to me and Blizzate. Although, some might say Blizzate was hacking, which might have some truth to it. Even though he was screen sharing. So. You can you can say what you want about Blizz. But I, I was there. And I, I kind of watched him play. I, I'm not going to say anything. But, um, yeah, unfortunately, he Blizz did kind of have to leave. Blizz was kind of like. He was he was my duo now. Um, for a very short amount of time, but again, like I said, this video really cemented, this video actually, like, expressed my true skill in Shell Shockers, and not only a good video, like, it was entertaining to watch, but also just, like, it was freaking impressive. I had some clips on that. Next, speedrunning Shell Shockers. Honestly, I would say this one's a, hmm. I'll say this one's a high good watch. It's actually pretty entertaining. It's very short. I think it's my shortest, like, new age kind of video. It's only three minutes long. Um, but yeah, it was... I broke every single speedrunning record at the time. Although I think the 10 kill streak has been beaten, like, eight times over now. But at the time, this was pretty darn impressive. People were talking about it. They were like, what the frick? Nova just beat everybody's records. And two of them, the 20 kill streak and the 5 kill streak, still hold up today. And I th I am considering getting the 10 kill streak back. So, I would say that is a good watch. Next, PLG Nova's best moments of 2023. I would say this is a banger. This is a banger video. Although, I will say. It is probably not as much of a banger as some of the other ones. The reason why I think that is because this video, although it does have the absolute funniest, the most entertaining parts of my whole channel throughout that year, and it also introduced some new clips that I bet not everybody has seen. It did not have a story to it. All these other videos... They have a story, right? They impacted something or someone. Or it was just like an event. The events always have a story of like... 
me doing like being the underdog and then suddenly winning like a lot of a lot of these event videos they all have a story like all of them they're with somebody else this one is just a compilation of what already exists it was nothing new it was just a compilation of what already exists and what most people have already seen just piled into one that is that's why i think that's a big and in that well how long did we record jesus christ 30 minutes i apologize but with that that is that is the plg nova video tier list i don't think i have this public actually maybe i do i don't even know i don't think i do because probably not a lot of people would actually use it but yeah, I feel like this is actually a pretty accurate tier list because, well, I, I'm i Nova. I made these videos. So I think this is like almost objective at this point. But yeah, if you, if you want to tell me in the comments which ones you would change around, which ones you put, you would put at, I don't know, some of the tiers. But um, yeah. Bye.